my lovely friends and welcome you all to Innovative Amazing Science with Sanana. I believe that you're doing great, so am I. And today it's going to be something different. So let's watch it. Today I want to veer a little off topic but I hope you will stick with me because at the end I'm going to tell you a secret. Are you ready? I stood alone on a high hill. It was a place where I took all my questions but received no answers, only more questions. I shouted out my troubles to the stars above the hill. The wind whipped these words away, bending and twisting them until they echoed back to me, haunting me. My thoughts never reached the stars and I began to feel very lost. This hill gives me no comfort. As I stood on the hill, my hand tightly grasped my most precious possessions, my balloons. They were like the idyllic dreams, perfect in every way. Each one was a brightly colored globe of light. Clustering above me, they shone together like the dawning of a rainbow. I could not remember a day without my balloons. Suddenly a voice uttered softly and said, those are the very beautiful balloons. I spun around to discover that I was not alone on the hilltop. A little woman with a silver hairline and blue eyes was facing me. She smiled gently and said, she used to have balloons like that. The conversation continued and she said that she let those balloons go. Tightening my grip on my balloons, I further asked the old woman, Do you miss them? Then she continued, Not really, because she saw them every day, she replied. And seeing my confusion, she continued, Look at that star. The old woman pointed to a bright star in the sky. That was one of my favorite balloons. Now I can see it every evening, so you can. I was so confused and further asked the lady, Do you mean that balloons can turn into stars? I asked in awe. She replied, Yes, if you let them go and let them try. But that is totally up to you and she disappeared. Her words lingered as I stood on the hill. There was a great silence in the air above like the atmosphere was straining to hear the notes playing in my head. As it acted on my quandary, a cool wind began to caress me. I felt a bit of comfort, but something was not right that was strange. Suddenly, the wind swelled with a full force gale. A huge gust knocked me over and I almost lost my grip on my balloons. My precious balloons. I struggled to hold on to them, but they were pulling on the strings reaching upward. Something must be done because my strength was waning. I tried but could not. I slowly released my grasp. My precious treasures tumbled upward into the air. And finally it ended. I know that all of you are totally engrossed with my real life experience. Well, as I said earlier that today I want to veer a little off topic so the story that you heard right now was not a real life story, but it was a dream. But after hearing the word balloon, we all would have gone back to our childhood days. And in fact, I would say we all love to play with balloons, isn't it? So today I'm going to share one very interesting activity with the balloons. Are you excited? Let's get started.
So the things required are a cellar tape, some needles, a pair of scissors and a balloon. So I have already inflated my balloon. So just look at my balloon. I'll use a needle and I'm going to prick it. What is happening? Let's observe. Did you see? The balloon got blasted. But I'm going to show you again the same balloon but whether it will blast or not let's just observe. Let's see what is happening. I just tried to prick one of my needle and then with the second, third and so on and on and still my balloon is not bursting. It's like inflated. Did you see the magic? Now let us understand the magic behind our activity. So for this I'll just cut the cello tip and put it on the balloon and then I will take the needles and then I'll start pricking to my balloon and let's observe what is happening. I will prick where I have stuck the cello tip. Did you see the magic? If you enjoyed this fun activity, do give it a like and if you want to share any other activities with everyone, do put it in the comment section or do write a mail so that in my future upcoming videos, I can share out your experience and activities with everyone. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.